Hello everybody, I hope you've got something to draw with and your paper ready. We're going to draw the animals down on the farm. I wonder if you can guess what this animal is going to be. Okay, we're going to draw this shape. And we're going to draw a little wing. And then my animal has a little tail. And it goes around and joins up. Do you know what it is yet? I'm going to put some little feet. I think you can guess. I'm going to put the crown at the top. A little beak. And our eyes. Lovely. Next, we're going to draw the ladybird. So this shape is a capital D that has fallen over on its back. We're going to do a straight line and a big curve. There we go. And then we're going to do our ladybird legs. They have six legs, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we can draw our little face on our ladybird. My ladybird's going to be happy. It's going to be looking over here. And then we can draw our spots on our ladybird. How many spots are you going to draw? I'm going to draw one two, three on my ladybird. Okay, we're going to draw our next animal, which is going to be a cute, fluffy sheep. So we're going to draw this fluffy cloud shape. Oh, so fluffy. And we're going to add the little feet. One, two, three, four. Next, we're going to draw our sheep's face. So I'm going to draw that fluffy line again. And we're going to draw the face coming down. I might add some ears. So I've got one ear, two ears. And then our little face, one eye, two eyes. And my little happy sheep face. Oh, so sweet. Next, I'm going to draw something that lives on the water. Or oh, it definitely likes splashing in the water. It's our little friend, the duck. So I'm going to draw my duck's head like this. I'm going to put some fluffy hair at the top. Maybe it's a baby duck. Oh. It's going to have its body coming around. We've got a little duck wing like this. And our little duck tail. And it's splashing in the water, so I'm going to draw the water like this. And then we can add our duck's beak. And the eyes. One, two. He's looking up at the sheep. So. Okay, I'm going to move my duck over here. And next, we're going to draw a little piggy. So I'm going to put my little piggy snout over here. I'm going to add my eyes. One, two. I'm going to draw the top of the head. I'm going to add my ear. So I've got one piggy ear and I've got two piggy ears. Next, I'm going to draw my 
pig's body. So I'm going to draw the little legs coming down with the trotters. One, two, and my piggy tummy like this. And the back legs, one, two. I'm going to put my piggy's bum up here. Silly piggy. And then I'm going to draw, my piggy is going to be happy, so I'm going to draw the snout and a little smile. Is there anything missing from my piggy? It's the tail. We're going to put a curly tail over here. Oh. Okay, I'm going to get some more paper. Put my pig over here. I have room here to draw my... What else lives up on the farm? A cow. So I'm going to start with my cow's bum. I'm going to draw it round like this. And a leg coming out. My cow is a silly cow. It's going to be jumping up in the air. So I'm going to draw jumping over here and we draw the back coming up and the other leg coming out like this and the neck oh i'm running out of space to fit my head draw my ear and my horn and then we've got another horn and another ear and I'm going to bring my cow's big nose down here. It's going to be happy. All the animals on the farm are happy. And they've got the big nose as well, like this. One, two eyes. And my cow is going to have some patches on it because they sometimes they're black and white. Sometimes they're brown and white, but you can colour them any colour you like. I'm going to add the funny udder down here and the back leg just behind it. And then, is there anything missing from my cow? It's the tail again. So I'm going to draw my tail up here. I'm going to put a little bow on my tail so that I can colour that one in. And next, I'm going to draw the dog. So I'm going to put my dog down here. I'm going to draw the tail first. Maybe my dog's going to be jumping up as well. I'm going to draw the tail and the back leg coming out. And then he's going to be jumping up like this. I'm going to put a collar on my dog, like this, it's a little rectangle, and then I'm coming down from there, and drawing the other leg, and the other leg comes behind. Silly dog, where are you jumping to? Let's add your head. I'm going to draw one ear over here, and another ear over here and I'm going to give my doggy a big nose so he's got a big long nose and happy again I'm going to draw the eyes a little nose at the end and my dog's going to have a little patch so I can colour that in I think I'm ready to colour in my animals now so I'm going to do that see you in a minute 